Hello, I'm going to go over the uh, new Skype for Mac uh, version 5.3, which I believe is much improved. Um, ever since version uh, 5.0, um, a lot of people have been hating it, uh, me included. The uh, UI for it was very hard to use. You couldn't find uh, hardly any of your contacts. Among other, uh, among other things. Um, one of the complaints I think was the large size. Uh, when it first came out it looked something like this. Uh, it was kind of large. You can shrink it down a little bit. Um, this is about the smallest you can get it. Uh, it's... Even on the Windows version it'd be, you know, still pretty large. Um, the size is... Uh, not bad I guess that hasn't changed much but there has been a lot of improvement I believe uh, from the last three versions or um, yeah three versions uh, one of the things uh, they tried to do was um, pretty much keep everything in one main window and uh, whatever changes you do it shows in the same window or the other ones that uh, pop up separate different windows uh, uh, to me, that's kind of a hard way of doing it, but... And another thing is contacts. Um, card contacts are very hard to find in here. Um, it, it's hard... Uh, you could search for it, that's be, uh, unless you know somebody's name uh, spelled correctly. Um, it did have this recent, like it does here, and but it, over time it actually disappear. Uh, you know, trying to search for the right person, but here the contacts is always there, so you click on it and you're good to go. And um, I'll, I'll give an example right here. I want to open a uh, text message, instant message, and uh, same window, no uh, pop up window with a drawer and all that. And then you just type your message. And obviously puts it in there for you. Um, now, if you're running audio and or video, um, it also do it in the same uh, main window. But about the last, uh, the bottom third would be where you put your text text message in, and then uh, you'd have to scroll if you wanted to see prior tech uh, messages. Uh, it automatically obviously scroll up as uh, new messages come in. And uh, now uh, another big feature is HD video. Uh, and uh, here's an example right here. And uh, it pretty much uh, looks a lot better than what it did. And it's something I'm very happy with because uh, often I send my Skype video uh, as well as audio to other tech shows uh, if I'm a guest on there or something pretty important other than just regular chat so uh, I think that's uh, obviously a good thing now I'm not using a regular webcam per se USB webcam I'm using actually a camcorder using a HDMI and you can see it's actually getting quite uh, good video for what it is and uh, actually it's also been tested uh, I tested it with uh, somebody for quite a while and they said they received uh, HD video uh, same great quality and I'm pretty happy with that now uh, say actually the uh, screencast is just as good and in fact I really surprised with it because um, that was also tested with somebody else um, uh, they'd ask to screencast uh, their desktop and it'd be so good, it's almost like looking over somebody's shoulder in their house uh, and looking it off of a monitor. It was uh, that good. And uh, vice versa, it was uh, tested both ways. Uh, so I was happy that, with that as well. And, uh, and uh, here's just we their website right here. Uh, go over some of the other features. Obviously, uh, HD video, group calling. Uh, more than two people, uh, obviously it's going to cost you a little extra for that. Integration with uh, OS X Lion, I'm not sure what the changes were needed, but that was added. 
And there's actually, uh, I'm going to go to the tips and tricks. There's also actually a few other things. Um, uh, I think there are some gestures for the magic track or the, uh, the track pad on some computers. Could be the, uh, uh, the Bluetooth track pad for the desktops and or the, uh, uh, their laptops. I uh, think there is, okay, we got push to talk. Um, I think some key combinations, uh, command W's, a few of them, I guess. And things like that. Uh, so if you're a Mac user and, you know, at least give it a try out. Give it, you know, more than just two minutes. Actually use it, call somebody. Uh, give it a couple hours time before you make a uh, uh, determination. I'm very happy with this much improved over